This is my first homework I've ever done in my whole entire life. You guys ready? All right, let's go do breakfast. Come on. Yes! So how did you sleep last night? Not that good, honestly. I woke up with lots of expectations. And excitement? Yeah. It's hard to go to bed when something big is happening. So today is the official first day of school for all four of our kids. They've been homeschooled for their entire lives up to this point, and this year they're going to a private school that's dual immersion, which means that half their day the instruction is in English, and the other half of the day their instruction is in Spanish. We're really excited for them to be learning Spanish and to have all these opportunities. There's a lot of emotions going on in here. We're excited, we're nervous, and everything in between. The kids' friends from Kansas City sent them good luck messages this morning on Marco Polo. for rinsing out your bowl. School uniforms. We have two different school uniforms. Today is PE. So Laura today does not have PE, so she's wearing the normal uniform. The kindergartners are on a different schedule. She has PE on a different day. Two, three, big smiles. Okay, Looking good. All right, we're loading up in the car. So many school supplies. Woo. Look at their cute little shadows on the wall. Oh, I have so much fun at school. Well, while the kids are at school, I'm on with Janae. I'm going to school too. You want to go to school too? Uh -huh. Soon enough. We'll get you going to school, okay? Okay. So the school that the kids are going to actually does have a preschool that once kids are potty right trained, back. they can go. Or will I come back? Okay, go get your clothes on. Okay, I've got a doggy for Do you have a leash on your doggy? Mm. We're doing a little snack of apples and peanut butter. Did you learn to get out in my pokey cup? And Janae just asked for water in her pokey cup. That's what she calls that cup. So I got Janae some chips and salsa, but she insisted on dipping her apple in the salsa. How is it? Good. Okay. okay. It's probably healthier than chips and salsa. You're all done? I'm going shopping. Are we out shopping? So Janae was very excited to get out of the house, and so we are at Walmart. We had a few more school things to pick up, and uh, some groceries. I actually have a special treat I want to make for the kids after school today, a little first day of school snack. So I gotta pick up that stuff and dinner. It's a thing, I need to make it. And I'm buying some of these because we have great adventures ahead of us. Here's a hint for our after school snack. And I picked up some Cool Whip and other stuff. Today was not my day for shopping with a two year old. It is hard <laughs> to be two and to shop. And it is hard to shop with a two-year-old. So we're gonna go home, have some yummy lunch, and take a nap, at least for her. Okay, do you guys miss the kids? Because I totally do, but the day is also going by really fast. Janae just went down for a nap, which she was ready for, and I just put dinner in the crock pot. I just put chicken and some teriyaki sauce in it, and then I'm gonna make some rice and some stir-fried veggies to go with that. And I'm making a special after-school treat for today since it's their very first first day of school for these kids. So I'm gonna make little dirt cups for the kids. That's just like chocolate pudding, Cool Whip, and oh, Oreos all crunched up and some little gummy worms. The snack that we basically never have, so it will feel like a special treat for today. So my friend Kylie has done this for years. She makes dirt cups for her kids on the first day of school and I always think it looks so cute and special because dirt cups are not something that we make all the time. So I'm doing it today. Chocolate pudding, Cool Whip, Oreos and gummy bears. No, gummy worms. It's very important that they're worms. That only makes sense in dirt cups. Chocolate pudding. Hopefully it doesn't freeze. <laughs> Since Kayla's gluten-free, we always do gluten-free Oreos around here. And I'm gonna crunch them up in my blender because I'm feeling lazy. 
Although then I have to clean the blender. So who knows which way is easier. Push the dirt button. <laughs> I like dirt. So now I'm just gonna layer Oreos, chocolate pudding, whipped cream, chocolate pudding, Oreos, whipped cream. Got me more. These are very professional. Mush it in there. Then we need a little bit more dirt on top. Look how cute. Yummy. They are gonna love this. It's time to go get the kids. I promised Laura that I would be the first person in line, so I better hurry. Okay, I'm excited to pick up the kids and hear from them how their day went. I don't quite understand the car pickup line. I'm gonna have to figure that out, so I'm just walking in to get them. I wanna see their faces. All right, I found all the kids. How was the first day? Good. Awesome. The best. Tired? Maybe. Are you hungry? Yeah. Okay. I'm tired of sitting. Yeah, you ready to play? Yeah. And home again. How did Spanish go? It went well, it was for sure the hardest class. Yes, I can imagine so. What was your easiest class? English, probably. That makes sense too. What was your favorite class? English or science. Well, the kids talk nonstop all the way home in the car because they all want to tell me all about it and I want to hear all about it. So I'm excited to chat for the rest of the evening with them. They're ready for their snack. Here's your first day of school. Snack. Thank you, Mom. <gasps> that looks amazing. Thank you. First day of school. It's first dirt school. with worms. First day of school. Let's go eat them over at the table. Thanks, too. Mom. Mom worked hard for the first day of school, too. They're all quiet now. Hey, guys. Which layer is your favorite? Vanilla. Mm. Vanilla. The whipped cream? I could have just put whipped cream in a container. The Oreo chocolate mix. That was amazing. This is my first homework I've ever done in my whole entire life. I mean, except for all the work we used to do for school was homework. <laughs> I mean, this is like, I mean. Coming home from school. Sure. I know. What's with that? But this is cool. I'm reading a story. Awesome. I'm glad you have a good attitude about it. Isaac is doing homework as well. They wanted to make sure he knew how to write in cursive. For one of Isaac's homework assignments tonight, they had to do like an all about me banner thing. Apparently they get put up in the classroom, is that true? Yep. So you get to see everybody else's? Yeah. His favorite candy is Luffy Taffy. His goal this year, to learn Spanish. Longitude and latitude. Geography, like my favorite subject. We have rice, stir fry, and chicken teriyaki from the crock pot. So we just finished dinner. How are you feeling? Tired. Are you extra tired? Yeah. Long day at school? I hope I don't feel like this for very long because I don't want to just like be tired every day after school. Yeah. I think it's normal. It's a big adjustment. Yeah. We are going to take showers and then we're going to snuggle up and go to bed. <laughs> Bedtime chess. I like the colors on this chess board. Elise just French braided her own braids. Looking good. Since I took a shower, my hair is wet. So in the morning, my hair will be nice and curly. It'll be ready right when you wake up in the morning. Great idea. We're putting all the kids to bed. Got another day of school tomorrow. Good night. Day has out. Oh my goodness, not getting distracted is not working. I am somehow in the little kid's shoe section. Janae wants to play with all the lizards. Nope, going back to bed. 